I definitely scored the winning penalty last year in the cup final against Huntley. 100%. Probably when I broke my leg up in Broda, put him out for a year. A tough year to take, like, but yeah, definitely that. I would love to play at Ibrox or Parkhead, but even a in it for Tawdry, all your mates and your family could come watch her. So what are that three? Yeah, I'm totally on the fence with it. I'm for it in certain scenarios, but I hate the fact that you can't celebrate a goal straight away, or well, you can, but it takes away the, the passion out of it. So yeah, I'm kind of I'm still undecided with that one. Every manager says the same thing to me: keep it simple and do what you're good at. Don't try and overplay. Just keep it simple. <laughs> keep it on the deck. Pass to the better players. Growing up, it was probably R9, him or Ronaldinho, even though I play nothing like them. Normally, it's Puddle, Gilly does it sometimes as well. They've got some good tunes, to be fair. I'm constantly Shazam and everything. <laughs> I say D Law is quite a good crack for that kind of stuff. There's a few of them, to be fair, when I took the Benidorm and I'll keep some, some of them stories quiet, but yeah, there's a good, good bunch of lads there, to be fair. But I like to say playing golf, but I'm quite partial to go to the pub quite early as well. <laughs> One of them, too. We'll say golf then, pub. Peaky Blinders are Game of Thrones, I would say. I was going to say Boat, but Jamie Mickey stole that one, so... <laughs> Probably my armband so I can swim home. Do you know what? I don't even understand what that meaning, what it means. So, <laughs> I'd probably say half empty, even though I've no idea what I'm saying. <laughs>